Francois is a sloth bear that was born at the National Zoo 24 years ago. He is a very unique sloth bear in that he is a very calm, social, and fun bear. He is a delight for the keepers to work with. Francois needs to learn to use the blood pressure cuff because Francois went through a period of lethargy and his nose and mucous membranes were turning blue. We did a full workup and exam on him where the vets diagnosed him with hypertension or high blood pressure. The goal of getting this information is first and foremost to take care of Francois, but secondly, we wanna have a bank of information of geriatric sloth bear blood pressures to share with other institutions. We're looking at trends. Do Mindy and I get one reading for a month and then next month that reading really dips quite a bit or goes up quite a bit? And that's the information that we're sharing with the vets. The blood pressure cuff that we use is a human blood pressure cuff and now it's been donated to a bear. The only modification that we did on it is the cuff itself used to loop through a piece of middle and wrap around and for safety reasons we didn't want to have that with the bear. In terms of training a medical behavior like this, trust is extremely important. The blood pressure cuff goes on Francois's forearm between his wrist and his elbow. When we do the training, you'll watch that Mindy always has her hand where the Velcro is so that she can immediately take that off if Francois chooses to withdraw his arm. We built it off another behavior, which he already knew, which was voluntarily presenting his arm for injection or for a blood draw using that white PVC sleeve. And before we even get the cuff squeezing his arm, I would squeeze his arm so he could start to get used to that feeling. And then it was presentation of the cuff. It really only took about a month to train this behavior. Francois participates in this training with a reinforcer of grapes so he works for very little. We try to take Francois' blood pressure at least once a week. There's not really a baseline for us to kind of be going off of. So in addition to training Francois, we're really getting a backlog of information that can help out the sloth bear community.